Hello YouTube and uh, welcome to another oversight of the weekly painting models. Now as you can see after nearly clearing the disc I loaded it all up again. Uh, mostly for the challenge but uh, a lot of things I've got to do as well. Now by next week you'll see that there's a whole new uh, amount of figures coming over. Um, so I'm probably gonna spend another evening one of these days uh, assembling models but um, this one will give me a start uh, and undercoat so it's like big heap uh, uh, if you've seen my uh, blog uh, you'll know I'm already at a thousand point mark and well I'm going for the 1500 I'm going to do it I will do it <laughs> I might do it uh, probably won't get there but uh, gotta motivate myself so that's what the unlock hobby is all about so um, for the entry next week this uh, pirate lass is uh, nearly done just need to base her I'm um, also going to try and finish the Minwood figure and that uh, dumpster guy which is now drying in the wash so that's pretty simple they've been here all week this guy is a freebooter pirate lord but I'm going to paint him like a red mage from Final Fantasy because I play a, a red mage in that MMO 6mm building that's for the very last entry then I got a Still Lil of Gris, really the starter, Albert 1 and uh, the violin player. Those who don't count for the challenge, yeah. that's something for me and my girlfriend, but we just didn't get around to paint uh, on them. Then I've undercoated the Chang Chinese Spearmen. Those uh, will probably be the first things I'll be painting as well uh, the coming days. Two more Noise Marines to bring the squad from a few weeks ago to five and make her playable. Some heavy artillery support for my Empress children with uh, another quad bolter and a laser destroyer then some uh, 15 millimeter dark dwarfs uh, I'm just gonna paint over there probably end up a P-Bay or something afterwards then these guys are uh, converted box walkers uh, they got some weapon swaps and everything so they'll be uh, the first unit for my uh, contingent of um, heretic rebel imperial guard trooper stuff uh, I can't remember how it's just called but uh, it's only gonna be 500 points, I just want to paint a pink lever rust, so I need an excuse to build a small force around it. And they're gonna be mutant travel, there aren't a lot of pistols, so I use bolt pistols. I'm not going to order other pistols, uh, especially for them. Then the remainder of uh, the late Romans I had from uh, the box set, so those are uh, all archers. I do will base them, because like in ducks, uh, <laughs> either your archers aren't hit or they're all killed in one go, so it doesn't matter too much. I'm going to paint them. Then uh, that's my Blood Bowl team, the, the bondage team from Gaspers Arts. Assembled them as well. So, uh, might start them for the challenge, uh, if not, uh, really shortly afterwards. Then I've got uh, the Demonets for the final bonus round. Uh, I'm going to start doing work on them really soon, uh, probably not this week, but the week afterwards. Then. Uh, the next American Civil War Regiment, uh, the one from last week, uh, is finished at uh, Pennsylvania, so this is going to be one of the New York regiments. Uh, not the Fighting 69, I'm keeping them for last, and I'll probably make that a full 40 model unit, or 36 model unit, uh, but a real big one. Uh, I'm still not sure what I'm going to do, but uh, uh, probably going to end up that way. So then. And 32 Dark Age Warriors, uh, it's also the remainder of a box item from which I only took uh, the Levi and some uh, separate models for uh, the Ducks campaign. So I assembled them all now and I'll be painting them in blocks of 8. Uh, it's always a point in Saga or a maximum unit for Ducks, so uh, it's a bit of the hole in number for me for uh, at the moment for uh, Dark Age models. But I've uh, equipped 16 with spears and 16 with hand weapons and that should give me more than enough figures for uh, well for both game systems actually uh, I think I'm going in Saga to 25 points or something so you know we play it what's it uh, 4 points 6 points 8 points uh, that range so yeah just for sure but as you can see um, that's uh, more than 100 models at the moment <laughs> I think it's nearly 150, I didn't count them, but I uh, like those two blocks, they, they count up quickly, add up quickly, so um, yeah, I also got this one, forgot her, it's uh, the Dullagreed, uh, one of the Crisis Limited Edition models, uh, that's for a personal project, but you might enter in the challenge as well, 
but that's it for this week so uh, by next week I will have the pirate girl finished I hope to have the midwit figure finished I might have the dumpster finished but it won't go in the challenge just yet because he's going to go with the mutant trouble as a I'm gonna make an objective marker from him and then I'm aiming for unit wise to paint one block of eight of the dark age warriors going to paint the Chang Chinese for sure and I might do some archers I'm not sure on that one yet so that's for this week on the goal and assemble more uh, like my tombstone cavalry band and everything and afterwards I am going to that's going to be like uh, by next episode I'm going to start working really on those demonets because their deadline is at the 3rd of March and uh, in the meantime I'll be probably hopping around between those two blocks first to get them done being the most intensive ones so uh, we'll see how it goes but uh, thanks for watching and see you again next week cheers